Uh, hey guys, what is up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It is me, Bailey, and in today's video, basically, um, y'all knew I was basic. Uh, it's no surprise, no secret, I am a very basic teenage girl, but today, we're taking my level of basic and raising it even higher. Um... Today I'm going to be transforming myself into a visco girl. So you guys have probably seen these videos floating around all like visco related like uh, visco this, visco that. So in today's video, yes, I'm going to be transforming myself into the ultimate visco girl. I think these videos started blowing up after Hannah Maloche and Haley Pham posted a video like turning into a visco girl for a day or something. I actually watched that video and I was like, hmm. This kind of sounds fun, like I kind of want to do this. But then I just never really like did it. And then so many other people posted videos, so it's not really like original at all anymore. But I still really want to do it, so that's why I'm doing it. If you don't know what Visco is, basically Visco is an app that originally people just kind of like edited their like photos on. But in the last year, it has completely blown up. It's kind of like Instagram, but it's like even more of like a perfect, trendy, atmosphere. I actually don't know what I'm talking about, but I made a list and it has all of the steps that I need to take to become a visco girl. So the first thing on my list to become a visco girl is to pick out a very trendy visco-y outfit. So let's look up what visco outfits look like and I'll put a screen recording right here of what I'm looking at. Okay, so I'm just gonna look up visco. That's not how you spell visco. Visco outfit. So right off the bat I'm seeing mom jeans, big oversized sweaters and t-shirts and sweatshirts, tube tops, a lot of oversized t-shirts and sweatshirts pretty much. After my time of doing a little bit of research looking at what visco outfits were, I have acquired a little bit of knowledge of what a visco outfit is. So a lot of the outfits were mom jeans with like a tube top or a tube top tank top-esque looking thing or big oversized shirts with like shorts basically if it wasn't oversized t-shirts and mom jeans it was like super tiny shorts and tube tops and stuff like that so i guess we could go two ways we could go like the oversized t-shirt route or we could go like the tiny tank top route i say we head to the mall and we go shopping and look for a few Viscoe clothing items. We're back. Okay, so here's a pack sun bag with some stuff in it that I just bought from the mall. I decided while I was at the mall, I want to go the big t-shirt route just because it's easier. And I feel like everybody just wears big t-shirts these days. So it's just like, you know, you can't go wrong with a big t-shirt. I have tons of big t-shirts, but I really wanted to get some new ones. Okay, so the first one I got is from PacSun. And it was actually in the men's section because all of the women's t-shirts are ugly. So I got this one and it just is like the Santa Cruz skateboards brand. It's a white t-shirt and it just looks like this. I thought the red stripes were like really cute and trendy and then the little like logo was cute and then the logo is on the back too really big. I thought this was the perfect shirt because another thing that's really in right now besides oversized t-shirts is girls who have no idea how to skateboard wearing skater brands and acting like they know a clue about skateboarding. So I think this is a really good shirt. I got another shirt however. This one, <laughs> this one I just kind of got because it's kind of funny. It's this yellow Taco Bell shirt. Um, I got this in the men's section at Target and it's a size medium so it's like pretty big. It's like this light yellow color and it just says Taco Bell. I thought this was kind of fun. I thought it was a little bit visco because like it's kind of like quirky and like colorful and stuff and like this yellow colors in so these are our two main options i'll probably wear that with like jean shorts or like little shorts that you really can't see the second step that i have to become a visco girl is accessories 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 a few very popular visco accessories are scrunchies shell necklaces like choker type things pura vita bracelets 
Uh, oh my gosh, beaded bracelets, like homemade beaded friendship bracelets. So popular. Don't worry, I did hop on the trend. Um, I have made multiples, so we have those in the bag, secured. I feel like we still should go to the mall and get a few more accessories. I got a few accessories. I do have a lot of basic as a I do have a lot of basic accessories already, so I didn't go all out, but I did definitely get a few things. So um, I got some scrunchies, <laughs> even though I have loads of scrunchies. I got two packs of scrunchies from Claire's. This one has really basic white, blue, and yellow one, which I thought the yellow would work with this shirt if we wear it, or like the white would work with the I don't know. I also got these two, which don't go with either of the shirts. I just thought they were really cute. This one's like velvety blue, and this one is like floral. Okay, wait, that's actually all that I got. <laughs> but don't worry, I have my own jewelry and accessories that we can wear. I just forgot about the most important part, a hydro flask. I actually don't have a hydro flask because I tried to stay off of that trend for as long as possible, but I think it's time for me to cave in. Let's head to Shields and get a hydro flask. Just stopped at Shields. Look how pretty she is. I just picked up this light purple um, 32 ounce hydro flask. Was it worth $40? No. And I don't like these type of like drinking things. I feel like the water always like, I decided to pick up this. It has this thing. Can you see that? Little straw. But yeah, I feel like we have everything that I need to transform. I really quickly need to say something because I just said that I have everything. No, I do not have everything. There's still so much stuff laying around my house that I need for the transformation for tomorrow. And I bought some stuff from Ulta that will be part of like the makeup transformation look for the visco look. So um, I don't have everything. I haven't shown you everything, but I just didn't know what I was talking about. So sorry but I'm not transforming until tomorrow because I'm too tired and the sun's already setting and I just need to live a whole day visco -y. so I'm gonna go to bed and I'm gonna wake up and turn myself into a visco queen! Hey guys, good morning. It is the next day. It's actually not morning. I slept in so late. Um, <laughs> it's 1.56 p.m. I slept till about 12.30 and I've just been on my phone doing absolutely nothing for the last, like, however long hour and a half. Sorry about my morning voice. Um, hour and a half. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna get started with our Visco day. I had a lot of stuff planned, like I wanted to go to like cute like coffee shops and stuff, but I just realized it's Sunday and the cutest place that I know is actually closed. So we're probably just gonna hit Starbucks or something, but I'm gonna get ready. And um, last night I slept in this huge oversized Harvard College sweatshirt because big oversized sweatshirts are in and so is like wearing college stuff that you don't even attend to yeah let's go over to the bathroom and start getting ready for our visco day i made it to my bathroom and i'm going to wash my face and do some skincare before i do my makeup while i'm doing my skincare and my makeup i'm going to be taking my most like visco trendy basic products that i have and using them just because that's just i, I don't know i'm very just doing that so the face wash i'm going to be using i don't really have any like marbadescu face wash or anything like that but i feel like the clean and clear like I feel like this is a pretty popular one. And then after I wash my face, I'm going to be using my Mari Badescu Exfoliator, which I love. If you haven't tried this, definitely recommend. It's good. So I'm going to brush my teeth and wash my face, and then I'll be in my room to do my makeup. Okay, um, you guys are actually sitting in my makeup brushes currently, and all my brushes are like sprawled about, but um, this is what we're working with. Right now, I'm sitting in my room at my little makeup vanity, and I just finished washing and exfoliating my face. And now I'm going to be showing you guys what I got from Ulta yesterday when I was at the mall. Ulta. So I stopped at Ulta while I was at the mall and I got two things. Obviously, I had to get some Carmex. So I got this pack of three. And then I got a new Marbadescu spray. I used it last night before I went to bed, so there's a little gone. But this was my last Marbadescu spray. And as you can see, it's like pretty much gone. 
I just decided that I want to be taking pictures of like the more viscoey things that I do. I'm gonna go ahead and get my Marbidescu exfoliator and I'm gonna take a picture of this with my Marbidescu exfoliator. I just took my first photo. Here's what it looks like. I'm gonna save all the photos that I take today till like the end of this video where I show you me editing them. Basically, I'm just trying to make my face look natural but still like... My makeup is done. I'm gonna open my window so you can see my face in the natural light. But this is what my face looks like. This is kind of like my everyday routine minus the highlight. So I think I picked out the outfit that I want to wear. So I'm just going to really quickly change into that. Guys, I have an issue. I really should have done my makeup after I got dressed because this head hole is so small. And I'm about to get makeup all over this shirt. Oh no! But it's see-through. No! I was worried. Mm. This is what the shirt looks like. I don't have pants on, but you does, it doesn't matter because you can't see my butt because... Um, it's an oversized shirt. It's not super oversized, but it's like good amount. I'm gonna probably put spandex on just because it's not that oversized. So I just put these Lululemon shorts on. I feel like Lululemon is also very popular on Visco. Like people are always posting like pictures of their little logos and stuff. So this is what the actual outfit looks like. I'm debating on if I should wear my Crocs with it or if I should wear my Vans with it. Okay, I just debated for about 10 minutes whether I should wear white and red Nike socks, like Nike Elite, or red fuzzy socks, and I, I, don't, I, I don't know which one is more trendy, more visco. I feel like I see fuzzy socks a lot more, but at the same time, I'm not sure. I think I'm just gonna wear fuzzy socks just because, you know, we all know fuzzy socks are basic. <laughs> now that I am all changed and my makeup is done, I'm gonna go into my bathroom and get accessorized, accessorized, and then um, I'm going to do my hair, do something with my hair. I wanted to get my nails done, like acrylics today, but my nail place is closed on Sundays. Why the heck is Carmex like popular? Why is it a thing? It's like too like greasy. I have a bunch of like little bracelets. These. I'm just gonna put them all on my dang wrist. Okay, um, I just put these all on my wrist and it looks like crap. I don't know how people get it to like look cute. Like I just don't know how to wear bracelets. Let's add some scrunchies to our wrist. There's no way I can wear this on my wrist too. Maybe I should just wear this one on my other wrist. Should I just wear a gray one in my hair? Yeah, that one's fine. But I feel like I should have another one on my wrist. Dang it, I really wish I had a red one. I'm just gonna wear this one on my wrist with it. This one's like velvety and then this one's just like cotton. And then I also have a hair tie. I'm just gonna do a simple half up, half down for my hair because I'm hot and I wanna use a scrunchie, but I don't want my hair to be all the way up because I look bad. Ew, 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 what? Whatever, I'm just gonna leave it. Wait, okay, I kinda feel like, kinda feel like the hair Ooh, I stop. Ooh, looking like a star. Oh, I forgot about my shell necklace. Gotta put that on real quick. This is not what Visco girls look like. I'm upset with myself. I should have worn a tube top. I'm gonna put some rings on because I feel like rings, like having rings on your fingers is very Visco-y too. Okay, this is enough rings, Jesus. How do I look so far? Okay, I'm gonna take a few more Visco-y type of pictures. The amount of times I've said Visco in this video, comment it down below. It just doesn't match. I have like this package right here with like a bunch of Vineyard Vine stickers in it. And there's a few that would look really good on this color Hydro Flask. But I just don't really feel like decorating it. Like I kind of want to keep it looking very like clean. I have this one from Florida that has like surfboards on it. But I also like don't want to put stickers on it. But also I do because that's super viscoey. Mm, I'll put stickers on it. Okay, I am back and it's been about like 30 minutes and I decorated my thing with more stickers and if you want me to be completely honest, I don't like it. I will probably end up taking all the stickers off except for this Vineyard Vines one, but some of these are really cute so I don't want to ruin them so maybe I won't take them off, but I just don't really like it. I just kind of did it for the freaking Visco picture in like this video. So if you haven't already, give this video a like because I seriously bought this whole thing. I bought so much stuff to do this video. I am putting in so much effort and I was going to make avocado toast or um, a raspberry like fruit parfait, but um, we don't have raspberries and we only have one avocado and it's not very ripe and I don't want to just like eat it just to eat it like I actually want to eat it. 
I'm gonna go outside and take some photos by my Jeep. If you didn't know, me and my dad have a white Jeep Wrangler and I love it so much. So I'm gonna go take some pictures by it and then I might actually change my outfit and then take more photos and then go to Starbucks because Starbucks is, you know, it's basic. Hey guys, I changed my outfit. I did love my, or I, okay, just wait. I didn't love the outfit I had on prior to this one with the big t-shirt and stuff. I mean, I definitely thought it was cute, but I thought I could be even more like visco-y. So I put some mom jeans on, these are light wash. And then I just put a black tube top on. Very simple, very plain, but very trendy. And then you can see my choker and all. It's just like, I don't know, it makes everything pop more because you're kind of just like drowning in the oversized tee. So I decided to change. I did take pictures in the oversized t-shirt look and I will edit those after I get home from Starbucks and show you them. But I'm gonna go take some more pictures in this. I'll probably wear my black checkered vans and then go get Starbucks because I want Starbucks. They actually reversible, do you know that? Or the dragon drink. Dragon drink, okay. Yeah, but without fruit and light ice. The lighting sucks. Okay, so this is my drink. It looks a little ugly. Um, JK, it's cute and aesthetically pleasing because it's all white. But I did get a straw. I meant to say with no straw because I do have straws at home. But since they gave it to me and it's here, I'm just gonna use it. So sorry, turtles. Here's the tea. I just got this. So good. Okay, guys, so <laughs> I'm in my garage. I was just in the Jeep taking a picture disco of my stickers on my water bottle with the Jeep wheel. So I was just in here and I was like, why don't I decorate the inside of this to make it look cute? Like, you know, you see on Visco all the time. I just ran inside and I got some stuff to kind of decorate the inside of this. So I forgot my sunglasses, dang it. I'm going to put my Starbucks in one of the cup holders and it looks kind of gross because <laughs> this is really risky. I'll do it outside just in case. I'm gonna try to shake it till it gets the dry stuff at the top off. It looks a little bit better. Okay, so I'm gonna put this right here. And then I put the scrunchies that are on my wrist on the little like, um, thinger. Like how do people do this and make it look cute? I don't know where to put my car mix, girl. Ew, this looks so dumb. This ain't it, sis. This is not it at all. <laughs> Ew, this is the picture that I got. Look at the tit, like look at this. That looks so disgusting. You need to be, look how gross this cup looks with flash okay let me pull out into the garage or the driveway maybe and have like the natural sunlight hit it if this doesn't work i'm gonna be so upset because i literally ran my butt inside like three different times why is this seat so oh, i ran my butt into um the whatever it's called what's it called i ran my butt where's the sun at how's the lighting look no, uh... Okay, whatever, we'll just leave it here. I ran my butt inside to get, like, my Carmex and my Starbucks because I wanted to try, like, making the inside of this look cute because people always do that on Visco. But, like, this looks so dumb. This looks so dumb. I'm gonna hit the garbage can. Hey, um, I'm back. I'm inside now. I just sat on my phone for a little bit. Sorry, my room is a complete mess. This is embarrassing. I sat on my phone and I kind of deleted the bad pictures that I took today, or like that my dad took of me, and I narrowed it down to, um, where do they start? To these pictures. So everything that you see on my screen right now is pictures that I took for this video or as part of this video. The lighting is janky okay so my screen recording has started i'm gonna go over to my visco um as you can see on my screen i already started editing this first photo so um i'm just gonna show you i use the filter s2 on this so it just made it super bright and then i went over and i kind of just changed some of these things i'm not completely done yet i wanted to turn the saturation up because i see that 
is a really big trend amongst like visco photos like they're super bright and oversaturated i'm not going to explain too much what i'm doing it's just this i'm just i'm just doing this i'm just going to save it i don't want to post anything yet but i'm just going to save that and then i'm going to go to my next photo which i will do this one right here this is a picture of me just like in my window chilling i'm just gonna pick a filter for this i think that one kind of looks cool i really like c9 i'm gonna do c9 and i'm just gonna turn it down a little bit because i kind of like it honestly i'm not really gonna do much else to it i kind of like it how it is the next one i'm gonna do is this one with the jeep wheel which i'm sure you guys have seen these pictures usually it's girls with like acrylics on like showing them off but i just try to show off my scrunchies a little bit Ooh, this filter looks really cool with it i think i'm gonna do this one e4 and i'm just gonna kind of mess around with like the exposure and stuff <laughs> So this is the final photo for the Jeep wheel thing. I'm going to save that. Um, honestly, since I'm not really showing you guys what I'm doing to my photos, I'm just going to edit um, a few more like off camera and then I will show you them in a second. Okay, so I just finished editing all of the photos that I want to edit for like the ones that I, the ones that were my favorite. So I'm just going to go ahead and show you them. Okay, so this right here is the first picture and this is... Um, the one of the console. This is the last picture that I took and it has my hydro flask and stuff I actually really like how this turned out. Um, it's not as cute as the ones you see on like visco But I do definitely still like it. Um, the next photo lots of screen recording the next photo is this one here Let me turn my phone. This is one of me by my jeep my dad's jeep Um, I just put like a really brightening filter on it So the jeep looks really white in the ground and the background looks really white Um, you know, i'm just standing there in my big t-shirt in my hydro flask in my hand and my crocs on my feet you know i kind of look weird in it but like it's whatever it's zoomed out um then i took this picture and edited this picture and it's this one of me gripping the jeep wheel i don't know i thought it was cute you know you kind of get the vibe um then there's this one of me which i thought was kind of cute and visco-y because like you see my bracelets in it and then it's like brightly colored with my sunglasses and it's kind of like golden hour ish and then this was the first picture I took and I actually am obsessed with how this turned out like if I was doing a brand deal for Mari Badescu I would definitely post this as like a swipe picture on my Instagram, you know, you know what I mean? I actually forgot to edit this one. I forgot to edit this so I'm gonna go edit this one because I think this one can be kind of cute because you like see my choker and stuff So I'll be back again. So I edited that last photo that I just showed you that I oh my and I really like how this one turned out. Obviously, it's not something I would probably post on, like, Instagram or anything, but it's definitely, like, a Visco-y picture. Okay, actually, I'm so sorry for the amount of times I've said Visco in this video, and I'm so sorry about, um, how I look. <laughs> those are the pictures I edited. Um, those are the pictures I took. Hopefully, you think they were Visco-y. I know this video was kind of all over the place, and I'm so sorry. I, I haven't started editing anything from today only like yesterday's portion and i know that it's already long as heck and this is just even longer so i'm a little bit concerned about how long this video is going to be but i hope you guys enjoyed it i thought it was kind of fun i would like to do stuff like this more often like transformation videos or like living a certain day or living a certain way for a day if you guys have any like daily videos or like week-long video ideas if that makes sense i really enjoy Joy, I'd really enjoy if you could comment those down below. Yeah, if this video was bad. I don't know if this video was bad. Okay, I mean just it, it took a lot of work and I wish it was probably better, but this works. Okay, so give it a thumbs up if you liked it and make sure to subscribe before you go. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye